Carvco AI is coming and will be available from the 1st of September 2025 at the Carvco website. A 5% Carvco discount will be available in the video description below. Now be prepared to be amazed with the future of 3D CNC art and modeling. Next, I'm going to show you a photograph. Just imagine that you have a customer or family member come in with a photograph. Okay, so this is just a few photographs. I have played around with this a little bit and um, just going to show you this, although it looks an okay photograph, it is not high resolution and obviously the higher the resolution photograph uh, the better the outcome so I'll just show you this you can see it's a little fuzzy it's a low resolution photograph so if you use a low resolution photograph this is the type of result you're going to get and it's not the fault of the AI but uh, it is the fault of the uh, the, you know the, the sort of resolution of the photograph and I'm just trying to show you uh, the higher the resolution of the photograph the better the result I mean it'll generate um, a 3d relief but uh, obviously not I suppose you know if you pull that up I mean it's you can detect what it is but you know you'd have to have um Calco make a plus and go in here with some of the modeling tools uh you know it's not impossible to uh, improve uh on this photograph so i'm just lightly there i mean it will um, it will make a 3D relief of, you know, the pup and the, the kitten, but, uh, you know, you'd have to use um, uh, the modeling tools uh, in Cavco Maker Plus uh, to, you know, sort of carve it a little bit here and a little bit there just to redefine, you know, the eyes and what have you. The cat's not too bad. Pretty impressive when you in, you sort of lay the photograph over top of it, but um, like I say, this is a, a low resolution photograph. So let's go back. Let's uh, replace that photograph with. Oh, here we go. Nice German Shepherd. See what this one does. It's a much better photograph. Oh yes. Look at that. Let's go the relief. What a beautiful photo um, 3D relief that is. So let's bring the de detail up a bit. Oh look at that. I don't want to go too high. Yeah, it's a bit too much there, but there. That's quite highly detailed. And let me see. Bring the depth up a little bit. Let's bring his nose out a bit. Like that. And then bring the back, the zero plane. I want to keep his ears. Possibly could make him a little deeper. Don't want his nose too pointy. Uh, a little bit too far, so. That's better. 
and you can tell immediately what that is. Look at that. Oh, what a beautiful boy. That I really like. That's okay. So uh, let's try a slightly different one. As I'm just running through these fairly quickly just to give you a a um, a little bit of a look. Um, let's try some pups. Okay. Now you can imagine if a breeder comes in and uh, brings you a photograph like this and says, oh, can you have my pups for me? And you can turn around and say, uh, well, yes, I can. Turn the detail up. Nice to get their fur. And it's as quick as this, you know, zero plane, bring the zero plane forward. Like that. And you have a perfect group of 3D relief of some pups. Look at that. Spectacular. So there's that one. Let's just try something else. I do like German Shepherds. I've got a couple, so <laughs> that's why I use German Shepherds. Now this is a, a nice fo high resolution photograph. Let's generate a 3D relief of this. Okay, depth. Let's make them a bit deeper. And we'll bring the detail up. It's nice to have the, you know, the, you can, so you can see the fur. That's, that's pretty good. Zero plane, bring that back. Like so, just don't lose too much. Let's have a look here. Okay. That's pretty good. That's pretty damn good. Look at that. Perfect. Okay, so you know, that's just a very quick demonstration of the type of thing that you can, you know, decent photograph, you're going to get a decent 3D relief out of it. 